We've already gone past the days when electric bicycles served the sole purpose of transporting us from point A to point B. Nowadays, manufacturers are trying to stuff their products with as many useful features as possible. For example, the new Mock Wheel Basalt has designed as a mobile power station on wheels, and it seems like something any camping or overlanding enthusiast has been dreaming of. Every basalt model is shipped with a power inverter that could juice appliances with the total consumption up to 1,000 watts. This means that you would be able to charge your phones, cameras, portable camping fridges, or even small electric grills just by using the basalt's integrated 48-volt, 20-amp-hour battery pack. Once depleted, the battery could also be recharged with the help of aftermarket solar panels. Speaking of the e-bike features, the basalt is brought into motion by means of a 750-watt electric motor. It is powerful enough to conquer hills with 25% inclines and can let you reach 28 miles per hour speeds on throttle power. The list of other noteworthy features includes a Shimano 7-speed derailleur, 26 by 4 inch puncture resistant fat tires, hydraulic disc brakes, a multifunction color LED display, and a 400 pound cargo carrying capacity. Recon Power Bikes is an American company that has gotten famous for producing high-performance electric bicycles with heavy-duty capabilities and components capable of withstanding the toughest all-terrain riding conditions. The company's reputation may be the reason why GMC decided to choose Recon Power Bikes as their manufacturing partner for the newest GMC Hummer AWD e-bike. In order to match the fearless spirit of the newest GMC Hummer pickup, the GMC-branded e-bike will come equipped with two electric hub motors rated at 750 watts each. This dual powertrain system features a torque vectoring technology and is capable of putting out the peak power output of 2400 watts and 118 pound-feet of torque. The power to the motors is supplied via a 48-volt, 17.5 amp-hour battery pack with LG cells. As a result, you can ride at speeds up to 30 miles per hour and cover distances up to 50 miles between charges. Other noteworthy features of this bike include four piston hydraulic disc brakes, Shimano 8-speed drivetrain, a front suspension system, 4-inch hybrid tires with puncture protection, and a color LCD control display. EB50 is the first attempt of the Okai brand in creating an all-electric bicycle. It's a Class II fat tire bicycle with a step-over aluminum frame that can be painted either blue or black. In order to be in line with the Class II e-bike standards, the Okai EB50 has been limited to a speed of 20 miles per hour, even though the installed motor has the peak power output of 1,000 watts. Please note that there are some reports claiming that with the most recent Okai phone app, the top speed limit could be switched to the 28 mile per hour mark. Besides having a powerful control app, this model is equipped with a customizable LCD touchscreen that can show the speed, battery charge status, selected pedal assist level, ambient lighting parameters, or any other options you choose to activate or display on the screen. Owing to the installed 26 by 4 inch fat tires, an adjustable fork suspension, and dual mechanical disc brakes, the Okai EB50 is capable of providing a comfortable riding experience both on the tarmac and on the dirt trails. The e-bike's 48-volt, 14.7 amp-hour battery pack is neatly integrated into the frame and can keep the good times going for up to 45 miles between charges. Moped-style e-bikes is the latest craze in the world of urban mobility. Even though these look great and it seems that every reputable e-bike manufacturer has one of these in their model ranges, moped-style e-bikes usually just replicate the moped looks while offering the bicycle-like performance. Lyric Cycles from Canada decided to change this trend and actually produced a two-wheeler that has a factory VIN number so it could be both registered and properly insured. Lyric Cycles Voodoo is built around a trellis frame has a circular LED headlight, a faux tank area, and a variety of vintage cafe racer design elements. The bike is rolling on a set of motorcycle wheels and has a conventional motorcycle fork in the front and a mono shock suspension in the rear. 
This two-wheeler is brought into motion by means of an electric powertrain consisting of a 3,000-watt electric motor and a battery pack good for up to 65 miles of riding. The installed hub motor has 18 kilowatt peak power capabilities, granting you the top riding speed of 65 miles per hour. The Voodoo is offered with a set of bicycle pedals, so you'll be able to reach your destination regardless of the available battery charge. Lyric Cycles are currently collecting pre-orders for this model and will ship the Voodoo in the spring of 2023. There will be two versions available, the Base Cafe Racer and the Scrambler modification. X26 is yet another member of the electric mobility market that was born as a result of a successful crowdfunding campaign. There are several things that might have inspired the backers to put their money on the line and support this project. The upcoming e-bike received attention-grabbing design cues and a great technological package, making it suitable for city commuting and all-terrain riding at the same time. This two-wheeler is equipped with a 750-watt electric motor and a battery setup consisting of two 48-volt battery modules. They have the combined capacity of 1,373 watt-hours and are neatly hidden inside the frame and the top tube. With such powertrain specifications, you can easily cruise around the city for 60 miles at speeds close to 31 miles per hour. In city conditions, an integrated rear rack will become especially handy as it could be used for either carrying a passenger or transporting your cargo. Moreover, the model also features a folding mechanism for the ease of storing and transportation. As it has been mentioned before, the X26 has been built with versatility in mind, so it has a list of components that make it suitable for all-terrain riding as well. The bike is riding 26 by 4 inch all-terrain tires and has a robust suspension system. It consists of three elements, a 150 mm hydraulic shock in the front, a 30 mm mechanical shock in the middle, and a 40 mm shock in the back. With an 8-speed gearbox and up to 1,000 watts of peak motor power, the bike will easily climb hills with up to 30% inclines and offer the class-specific stopping power thanks to the installed hydraulic disc brakes. Aerial Rider is a performance e-bike manufacturer that has become popular with the EV crowd thanks to its powerful moped-inspired bikes. For the upcoming model year, the company's trying its luck in a totally different bicycle class and introducing the Aerial Rider Kepler model. This product inherited the company's spirit and is equipped with a high-performance electric motor. It has 1,000 watts of nominal and 1,800 watts of peak output. Such motor specifications will let you travel at speeds close to 32 miles per hour. Such a powerful electric motor had to be matched to a not less powerful battery setup. The bike is juiced by a 52-volt, 20-amp-hour removable battery pack, which can reportedly last up to 71 miles between charges. The remaining battery charge, as well as other performance metrics, could be looked up on the bike's LCD display. Being a true city commuting vehicle, Aerial Rider Kepler is shipped with a sturdy rear rack that could be used for delivering goods or transporting groceries. The list of the model's other important components include hydraulic disc brakes, a front suspension fork with 80 millimeters of travel, rear LED lights, and a sturdy frame, capable of withstanding 300 pounds of payload capacity. Blix Ultra is the most powerful model in the brand's current lineup and one of the most versatile electric bicycles that exists today. The frame of this e-bike features a modular rack system with smart mounting points, thus allowing you to use Blix accessories to customize the two-wheeler to your needs, be it distant camping getaways through the muddy hills or daily grocery shopping trips. Blix Ultra Bike is suitable for riders between 5 feet 5 inches and 6 feet 2 inches tall. It is rolling on a set of 26 by 4 inch low-pressure tires that work together with the front suspension fork to provide the smoothest ride possible. Unlike most mountain bikes that only have an electric pedal assist system, this model is also equipped with a thumb throttle. Once engaged, it lets you unleash 750 watts of motor power and effortlessly ride at speeds up to 28 miles per hour. Besides boasting a modular design and a powerful e-motor, Blix Ultra has one of the best battery setups in its class. 
With two 48-volt, 672-watt-hour battery packs on board, you can travel up to 80 miles without looking for a power outlet. In order to track the battery performance efficiently, Blix Bikes have developed the Blix Connect app. It lets you switch between Class 2 and 3 e-bike settings, use GPS navigation, control integrated LED lights, and much more. Kakuka is an emerging electric bike company that has developed a new fat tire, full suspension electric bicycle and is currently seeking funding to start the mass production process. Their Rampage bike is aimed at thrill seekers who like to take an occasional trip down the muddy country road, where good grip and traction are important. This two-wheeler is offered in two power modifications and rolling on a set of 26 by 4 inch fat tires. Besides having a set of grippy tires, the Rampage also features a full suspension system and a 7-speed gear system by Shimano that comes especially handy in off-road conditions. The base bike modification is equipped with a 750-watt motor and a 48-volt, 960-watt-hour battery pack suitable for 50 miles of continuous riding. The Rampage Pro modification has a slightly more powerful motor with 1,000 watts of output and a 48-volt, 1,176-watt-hour removable battery pack. The Pro model is said to cover distances up to 62 miles at speeds close to 32 miles per hour. It should be noted that both modifications come with a 4-inch, high-definition, waterproof color LCD display, a torque sensor, 26 by 4-inch fat tires, hydraulic disc brakes, adjustable headlights, and an integrated rear light. Volcon, a Texas-based EV startup, is slowly but surely expanding their lineup of electric personal mobility vehicles. After bringing to the market an electric dirt bike last year and unveiling a side-by-side -side model this year, the company is planning further ahead and is already teasing an introduction of yet another model. Their Brat Bike is set to compete in the motorcycle-style e-bike market segment that is especially hot nowadays. The Brat Bike will feature a cafe racer-inspired design with an elongated leather seat suitable for riding up to two, 20 by 4 inch mixed terrain tires, a rounded headlight, and a storage area stylized as a fuel tank. The storage area is also said to have a built-in USB port for phone charging. The two-wheeler will be suspended by an inverted telescoping adjustable fork and a rear monoshock. There will be hydraulic disc brakes, a rear hub motor, and a multi-level pedal assist system. The hub motor will have 750 watts of continuous power output, so you can expect to have 28 mile per hour top speed capabilities. The power to the motor is to be supplied with a 750 watt hour removable battery pack, suitable for up to 30 miles of electrified riding. Our team is working hard on bringing the latest and greatest news from the world of electric two-wheelers. If you'd like to support our efforts, please subscribe for further updates and feel free to share our work with your friends or request new overviews in the comment section below. Thanks once again and till next time.